and welcome to another Driving in MacArthur. Today we're driving around the streets with a lovely couple who happen to be working for us, Jade and Theo. How's it going? Good. Pretty good. We chose you two because you're very special people um, and also very recently you celebrated a wedding anniversary. We did, one year. In one year? Yes. Um, I remember the wedding. Uh, Theo, how did you go for the anniversary gift? Yeah, I think I got that down pat. <laughs> It's a competition. I, I heard you got a thumbs up. Yeah, always. Just don't keep ruining it for the boys, right? So. <laughs> Pretty unique to have a couple of people in our business who are also married. You met at work, yeah? That's yeah. correct. Um, so a bit of a story. So Theo, currently Hyundai Assistant Sales Manager, Campbelltown. Yep. And Jade uh, looks after the finance department for us at Campbelltown, Group Business Manager. Yes. Um, so two very important roles. Do you actually have any conflicts at work? Do you have any arguments? Um, you come across each other a lot? Nah, she probably saves that till we get home. <laughs> Jade, how long have you been working with us for? I have been working with you for 10 years. Yeah. This year. Started as an aftercare consultant? I did. 12 months at Camden Town and then uh, started at Camden not long after the Camden Valley dealership opened yeah. as the first full time yep. aftermarket consultant out there and moved into finance in 2012. Well, I manage um, a group of six other business managers. Um, I help them with um, making sure all of their applications are as they need to be, help them um, put approvals across the line and uh, try and produce the best result that we can for the dealership. And Theo, you've been with us for how long? Total? Seven years? Yeah, I think it was. Seven, eight yeah. years, yeah. yeah. Started in Holden in new car sales. Yep. Then from there, spent a bit of time, went from that division to Platinum. Now I'm in Hyundai. In terms of Hyundai, um, also had some success probably 18 months ago now, was it? Yeah, be eight, yeah. 18 months, yeah. That's yeah, right. where you were selected for representing Hyundai dealers or sales consultants in Australia. Correct. Tell us the story. So I had to go overseas to compete against every other country in Korea for a competition of all knowledge across Hyundai. How'd you go? I enjoyed it. I did. <laughs> Touchy subject, but I enjoyed it. <laughs> the touchy subject is that they get you to do a product presentation. Yes. And <laughs> at that stage, we didn't have a certain product range in Australia that no, they asked you to present. You didn't even know it existed. No. So. That was fun. So I, I, you had to I'm wing glad it. that I yeah. wanted yeah. a little bit. Yeah. You had to wing it. So <laughs> it we, we said that you won just by default, given the fact they gave you a well, car you didn't know anything about. That's true. And I did win Australia, so that's, that's a bonus. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. What was the car? Uh, the Ionic, which we're currently sitting in. So just briefly about this car now, I know you've just been um, brushing up. Yeah, a bit of pressure <laughs> considering last time I experienced in these vehicles. Um, so we're in the plug-in hybrid at the moment. This is the premium model, so it's your top range. Obviously you've got all your standard comfort features like your heated seats, your ventilated seats. But the biggest thing of Hyundai is they're going for the whole green emissions yep. now. So we've got three different vehicles, a full electric, yep. a plug-in hybrid, and yep. a hybrid. And this that's in the Ionic range. That's correct. There's also Kona. There is the Kona as well. We've also got a hydrogen car that's been rolling around for a bit too. Yep. So yep. Come quite a long Nexo? Way. Is that the Nexo? That is the Nexo, yeah. Uh, anyway, enough about cars. So, um, some of the fun times that we share, Jade, uh, would be when we talk about food and beverages. Yes. Uh, you've introduced me to a few fancy cocktails. I have. And also food, a bit of a foodie. And the funniest thing with you guys is that um, as a freshly married couple, you know, uh, working lifestyle, you don't have a lot of time to prepare for food, food. so yeah. often you do uh, Uber Eats. We do. Yeah, the, stopping and, now. But, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but the funniest thing, I was talking with Jade about it yesterday, she doesn't have the Uber Eats app on her phone. And I said, well, how do you order Uber Eats? She goes, I message Theo. <laughs> so if I'm so out... You're and, now Uber yeah, Theo. I'm yeah. Uber Theo. So if I'm out and she's hungry and she's not bothered, I'll get the message, can you order food? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but one of the other quirky uh, beverages that you've spoken to me about, which I thought we might go and have a bit of a crack at, is, um, what do you call it? Bubble tea. Bubble tea. Mm, chai, time. Chai, chai time? Yeah. I have been there before, and I have no idea what I'm ordering and or what I'm drinking after the fact. You're going to educate us? He's probably a little bit more of a hero. Yeah, well, yes. he, has a, he has a history of being an espresso uh, yeah. king. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Barista? Yeah. I just take recommendations and go along. Yeah, right, okay. Yeah. A bit like me. So you listen to what people who are experts tell you and then run with it. Yeah, except what? for coriander. Yeah. Well, we're going to get to coriander later. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, barista? Yeah. What are we going to order? I don't know. See, I like to just basically guess. 
Okay. At the end of the day, I'm not going to know if you like something until you try it. We have an ongoing problem where when we go out to dinner, yep. I've already researched the menu, know exactly what I want. Yep. She'll decide on the spot. Yep. And, and then, then you stare at my food. Yeah. 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 Order Envy? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we were talking before about food and uh, your exotic tastes and stuff, but one of the things we've discovered, I haven't asked you Theo, but one of the things we've discovered, I'm assuming you're normal. Oh yeah, no, I'm not. <laughs> right. So, like so, the, so, so the, um, and it's caused a bit of consternation at work because yes. we had a bit of a survey about people that like or dislike coriander. You detest <laughs> coriander? I detest coriander, it's horrible. And another ingredient we found out afterwards. Saffron. Saffron. Mm. So, oh, Jade, where'd you grow up? I grew up in Rosemeadow. Rosemeadow? I did. And you're a relatively sporting young lady. I was. Often telling people of your exploits. You played hockey. I played hockey. Who did you play hockey for? Uh, West. Okay. Yep. Theo, so, yeah, what's your sporting prowess like? Didn't really have one. <laughs> nah, no, I, I played hockey. And, um... Did you play hockey too? I did. Yeah, I played hockey for a while. I grew up in Bathurst, so yeah, and archery. Sort of archery, that's cool. Not many people can say they're archers. I enjoy hockey because we're aggressively competitive. So yeah, yeah, we've discovered that. <laughs> we all know. <laughs> Who wins out of a thumb wrestle? I know the game night's always fun. Yeah, I bet. Monopoly. Monopoly. <laughs> Do you cheat? Me? Yeah, hundred percent. So you two met at work. Yep. Who broke the ice first in, in regards to you know romantic intentions? Me. How to do it? <laughs> Persistence is good. Just asked heaps of times, right? Yeah, it took <laughs> a while. Let's put it that way. Had to through the very long friend zone. It was actually the first day I ever been introduced to it. I was told to get out of office. Nice. Yeah, it tells me that a lot too. Yeah. <laughs> well, thanks very much for that. That was pretty fun. Mm -hmm. It was pretty fun. It's not often we get to, no, it's pretty much every time we get to eat and drink at the same time. And I do also thank you for coming in on your day off. Um, That's all you, right. You're in your civvies. I am in my civvies. Um, so, it's the only day we can kind of organise it. Jade's always at work. Yeah, that's true. Enjoy your day off, Leah. Thanks. Get back to work. <laughs>